After coming across a full page advertisement displaying a new fund offer which is an NFO for a mutual fund, Ananya from Faridabad made up her mind to invest in them. But she was surprised when she saw an image in the ad which was marked as a riskometer. What does this riskometer signify? What does it mean? Well, knowing all about a riskometer is very essential for every mutual fund investor like Ananya. In 2021, the market regulator, which is SEBI, introduced a slew of measures aimed at making the mutual fund market easy and accessible for investors. Now, in order to make all risks associated with investing in mutual funds more transparent and understandable, SEBI introduced a riskometer amidst labels which depict how risky a mutual fund product is. Simply put, a riskometer is an image that accompanies the NFO advertisement of every mutual fund which depicts the level of risk involved in a mutual fund product through an arrow. Now, there are six levels of risk in them, starting from low and going up to extremely high. Now, in accordance with SEBI's guidelines, every mutual fund scheme is allotted a risk level. Starting from January 1, 2021, the categories designated by SEBI are low risk, low to moderate risk, moderate risk, moderate to high risk, high risk and finally very high risk. SEBI evaluates the risk meter of all fund houses on a monthly basis. The fund houses have until the 10th of every month to determine the risk level of their funds and publish the same along with other portfolio disclosures. In addition to all of this, any changes made to the risk meter has to be promptly communicated to the mutual fund unit holders by means of newspaper ads, SMS and emails. Not just that. Fund houses are also bound to inform in their annual report the state of a risk meter at the beginning of the financial year and how many times has it been changed during the year. Now, this annual report has to be made available online by the fund house both on its own website and on Amphi. Speaking on this, Deepak Gagrani, founder of Madhuban Finfest, says that risk meter is beneficial for investors since it allows them to select the right mutual fund for themselves depending on their risk appetite. However, this should not be the sole parameter on which one should base their decision of buying a mutual fund on. Other factors should also be taken into account. Riskometer is a useful resource for investors who wish to understand the risks associated with a particular mutual fund scheme. Different riskometers for different funds indicate that not all mutual funds have similar underlying risks. Financial experts advise that the risk meter should not be the sole influence on your decision to buy a mutual fund. Before investing in any scheme, investors should consider factors like their investment horizon or the time they wish to stay invested in them, risk appetite and much more. In case an investor is confused about their risk bearing capacity or about how much risk they should ideally take, then they should immediately consult a financial planner.